sticked out the entire thing. This is another one. Bounce against Snake makes it so much harder for Snake to play the actual matchup, but obviously has, a, I think, a little bit of an easier time than Samus. Mm -hmm. I, I'm, I'm excited to see how uh, her jet does it, especially being a character, again, like you said, like a little bit rusty, but like against Hero, I, I feel like you, you got to warm up just a little bit. And it's, it's yeah. just looking a little warm at the start of this game, at least. And the crazy thing here, too, is that I feel like anytime Hero has Accelerattle and like you, they get Snake off stage, it's almost a guaranteed stock just because of how much they can move, how slow Snake is recovering. It's it's almost guaranteed every time. Oh, yeah, 100%. Like, here, again, again one, of the, one of those things where Hero's spells makes a matchup like swing in his favor so well. Here we have her jet locking on the ledge very, very well. Again, like... Uh, Solo hasn't had time really to pick a spell yet, you know? Like, hasn't had time to sit back and read the menu. Because from the get-go, her jet knows the vibe. Saying, I don't have time to set up my grenades and my C4s. I gotta get in there because the second of the wrong spell comes out, my stock is gone. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. Up tilt through, not gonna find the connection there. And this is where things get a little bit scary. That was actually a great recovery from Solo. Oh, whoa, oh. <laughs> yo, yo, imagine, yo, what if? Honestly, just a great reaction from Sensei to, you know, take the Nikita and put it above one of the platforms, just trying to see if they can catch uh, Hero on that zoom recovery. Oh, man, but, you know, like, her just still locking up. Oh, the Accelerate got canceled! It went away! That's crazy. That, I've never seen that. too, right? I, that was, yeah, he lost 18 mana. That, I, that's a first. Huh. That's insane. Okay, wow. that's the thing. The more you know. <laughs> Good stuff there. Again, like, like these grenades are doing so, are doing such a good job of calling out these spells and the dash tap. We're seeing Herjet coming in and putting on the aggression whenever he can. But again, the second Sola gets comfortable, the second you have time to think on stage, once the spells come out, it becomes so much harder. But Herjet sitting in the lead here very, very well. Again, like, dude, like this snake is in such a good job of holding on to this lead. Mm -hmm. Okay, dash attack through. Not going to be able to find the hit that they need. Man, Sensei's holding on to this stock very well, too. Sola's definitely struggling here a little bit. Well, here comes the Psych Up. Be careful. And the Up Throw is most certainly going to do it. You have the Psych Up. Yeah, yeet. Get him right out of there. Uh, up you go. <laughs> but now, okay, a couple side Bs. Not going to find... Uh, well, found a hit on the second one, but... Yep, using Ooh. that Nikita once again there. The dash attack, nice. Actually keeping him from the ledge. Ooh. Oh, just a little too early. <laughs> So close yet so far. At 123 though, Airjet trying to take the stock here with an opto. And there comes the op smash. And that's what I said. Jimmy in shambles in the player cam, bro. <laughs> Went from in a very comfortable lead to suddenly all the way down. I love that recovery there from Solo. Yeah, that's actually been a couple times now. I feel like Sensei needs to get to the point where as soon as he sees that recovery, drop in the Kita and just go for the full punish there because I feel like he could have uh, definitely taken advantage of this, could have even up stocks. Oh, and there's the bounce online. We've been talking about this. And at 139, too, is going to make it a lot harder for Sensei to close the set. Psych up online. Here comes the back throw. Of course, you can't go for Nikita or up smash because, you know, the, the reflector makes it so much easier. Dash check in the corner as well. Bounce offline. Down tilt still not going to do it. Her jet struggling to take a stock here. Going for a crazy forward air and gets called out saying, hey, you want your spike? I got one of my own. Yeah, that was uh, that was certainly punishing. He's saying shake my yeah. hand. <laughs> game one, bro. After game one, bro. Oh, that's so oh. funny. That was that was ridiculous. That was uncalled for, bro. What, 32? 32? 32. I think... <laughs> I don't know where I heard it. I think Hero Crit Up Smash is the strongest smash I can think like, tell, tell me if I'm wrong. Correct me if I, I'm wrong. I have heard at one point that when Hero was first released... I don't know if it's true. I don't know if it's been fixed or anything. There was someone I know who was playing Hero a lot, but apparently Crit Up Smash uh, actually just does full charge Up Smash damage and doesn't actually do the crit. Like there was oh. like a error in the coding. I don't know if that's true before. I don't know if that's true now, but it's something I heard and it's information I'm putting out there for someone to either confirm or deny. <laughs> I mean, if it's true, damn that full charge Up Smash is strong. Like yeah, I don't know, 100%. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. I'm going to say it's not true because that definitely looked like a crit up smash if I've ever seen one. Myth busted. <laughs> now we're taking this back to small battlefield. 
See, again, like, that's the thing. Once you lose a game like that to Hero, when you, you have a solid game plan, and he destroys your stock, and so that just pokes a hole in your mental. It's like, wait, was I doing the right thing? Or do I have to change it up? And we're seeing Kerjack kind of second himself, guessing himself going into this game. He's already down 100%. And Solo doing a really good job of catching him on that back foot. Ooh, probably a little bit early on that spike, uh, but definitely that is... <laughs> hey, is this yours? Sir, you dropped this. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> this is your wallet, right? <laughs> but yeah, that was a huge down smash. I don't know if that was a crit, but I know Hero hits hard enough to kill at that percentage as well. Woo! Oh my God, just barely avoiding that up smash. So sitting here comfortably with the stock lead. We have her jet dropping these grenades once again, just perfectly timing that down throw to avoid the grenade explosion. And you've got Snake offstage once again. We saw in the set versus Pharaoh, Solo's been finding a lot of this mileage when uh, her jet is offstage. Speaking of offstage, those zooms have been so clutch. Uh oh. Is that on? It's I have no on. idea. I saw them. Uh -oh. Yeah, <gasps> it was. Oh, I can take it just yet. Flame Slash. Zoom again, dude. dude. Well, you I know think Zoom the, has like a one in four chance of popping up when you're off stage. I th it's, it's very, very high. I think it's like 80% or something crazy like that. I wasn't going to find <laughs> Zoom actually popped up at the very end there before they died. <laughs> Unfortunate timing, but Kaboom comes out, Ooh. bounces online. Accelerado, you were talking about this. Snake recovery versus Accelerado is not very great. We're seeing her trying to lock down the stage once again. I'm going to opt for more of those F-tilts. Solo up here at 98%. Zoom comes out once again. You know, a big thing of Snake's game plan is locking in the ledge with a really good ledge trapping. And with Zoom, you just can't do that. Yeah, it's definitely it's definitely a bit rough there. But there's that back air coming through. It's It has a bit of a wind-up to it, but man, it covers so much space. It hits so hard. That's uh, <laughs> Snake's pressing B button because that's what I know. <laughs> and unfortunately, bounces right there waiting for you. Oh, yeah. Unfortunate way for that to lose stock. Now we've got so uh, these buffs still online. Zoom comes out once more. Dude, I need a zoom counter. This is he's not even in the blast zone. He's fighting these zooms so often. Ooh. Still covering the, the platform super well with these uh -oh. nares. Uh oh, uh oh. This is what you were talking about, Skiff. This is, this is the hardest thing in this match, Joe. Yeah, I mean, because all of his hits, besides. Oh, oh no! It. Close it, close it out. That's done. <laughs> that move hit so damn hard. <laughs> it's actually ridiculous. <laughs> I think I it might like have, if they had like full charge, actually even amount the charge that they had, I think like snake at like 20% dies to that. That move is strong. Oh yeah, very, very strong. I think honestly, the, this matchup, I don't think snake loses to hero. I think snake loses to the menu. <laughs> like there are so many spells that just destroy snake's game plan. Like I can unironically see... magic burst, right? Like we saw that there. It, it, yeah. like, it just destroys your recovery. It just makes it so difficult. I, I can honestly, like, depending on the player, if they feel like their character wins this matchup or just goes even, I'm like, cool, whatever. You you know more about this than I do. But because, like, Snake has the tools to, I feel like, to beat everybody, right? He has, like, they're there. But I feel like Hero just has the tools, if played correctly, to just disrupt a lot of the stuff that Snake wants to do. I think it just comes down to the player at that point. Oh, yeah, the, like, the hardest thing. Is adapting to a lot of this, and we're seeing Kurja now taking more of the defensive approach here. I think for one of those grenades to set up. You got C4 in the center of the stage on FD, but now you've got bounce online. Suddenly, your C4 doesn't matter, your grenades don't matter, and Nikita doesn't matter. But so, has you at ledge trying to find a ledge trap here or something of the sort to take the stock off of Sola? Gonna catch that aggressive down air there with the F tilt. Oh, the snooze comes out, snooze, you lose. Very good first stock. Sola taking the first stock there in that game. Sir. Yeah, that was uh, a little bit unfortunate there, but. Hey, it is what it is. That's part of the game plan of when you're fighting heroes. You got to deal with some of the silly stuff. But there we go. Gets that neutral B. Two hitboxes, by the way. Technically two fireballs. So that's why you, after you saw the hit, another fireball was still going. That was nuts. Sola now has a psych up online at 45%. The stock could be gone with the next <laughs> hit. And he goes for AC. He just went for it there. I do not blame him. I do not blame him for doing that. It would have been very funny if it landed. That's all I'll say. Hero taking stocks off other people like 45% is always very funny. Not when it happens to me. When it happens to anybody else, it's very funny. Especially if it happens to Jimmy. Like, I love seeing that guy suffer. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what? Who said that? And it actually is funny when it happens to me. It's just I don't like it as much. 
But there we go, that back here once again, man. It's such Psych a up good Accelerado tool. bounce. Are you serious? What yeah, this I, is I'm terrifying. sorry for cutting you off, but like what kind no, of No, 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 you're, you're good. That? That's basically going Super Saiyan right there. Oh, he's turned up. Cool. Once you look like a Christmas tree, like it's it's game over. <laughs> oh yeah, this is these these are the uh lights coming out hot right now. Her judge is trying to keep his way in this, of course, one sock away from dropping out of this tournament. Trying to find anything. There goes the aggressive down here. There goes finally the mix ups that we've been needing. The Sis saving him from the. But still gets. Huh? Sis, does Nikita still hit him after the Sis? That was nuts. It might have, but I think he was pretty much like dead to rights regardless. That was unfortunate right there. Back throw. Yep. Put him off stage. All right. That, I like that. The immediate recovery to go high. Uh, just because, like, that's like the one spot I feel like if you can recover that. Hero's gonna have some trouble getting to you. Uh, so honestly, that was just well played and well scouted by Sensei to just not get caught up in that. Now we've got Bounce and Psych up online. <laughs> Sola just trying to find anything here. Urjet locking on here, trying to stay back in this game. Psych up off the table to that back air on the shield. Book a boom, whack in hand. Oh. Not gonna catch him there. Amazing air dodge. We're still gonna call the grab and that forward air overarching all the way out there. Sword break at Sola. 3 0 over her jet. Is Jimmy asking for an emergency? Is that allowed? Why is he still sitting down? Is he good? Hello? Wait. Oh, it was it 2 1? Is it? Yo, am I tripping? They played reverse mains the first game. <gasps> yeah, we didn't notice. Oh, it. they did? What the? What? <laughs> I didn't even realize it. That would explain why dude. the snake was on the black skin and not the red skin, because Sensei does run that. Dude, are you, dude, you look so stupid right now. <laughs> <laughs> are you serious? I'm like, well, it's a quick 3-0 from Sola. So, so we've only seen Hero win. So like, even when uh, Sola gets the W here, Sensei's like, well, I proved my point. <laughs> I got ridiculous. mine. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Okay, so anyways, it's 2-1, right? Sensei trying to turn up here. Okay, now now he's one game away from doing, dropping out of the tournament. My entire narrative in the trash. Thanks, Jimmy. This is why I, I, I like seeing you suffer, man. Because what the hell, dude? <laughs> oh, potential spike situation. No, backs off just to not deal with the Cypher. Gets hit by it anyway. Oh, okay, all right, all right, all right. All right. Oh. You've been dealing with crazy hero options all sets. Like, you know what? I'm going for Snake F. For it. I'm gonna. Oh, he, Ooh. <laughs> he almost got a crackle slash going the other direction there. Down smash, not gonna be enough. They get the crit either. Uh, he can get up there. I would advise to try and recover a different path. Missing the forwarder, that's huge actually. Oh, nah, not gonna find that. Ooh, they now turn it back on stage here. That's big. And now gonna catch that roll in there with the up till Snake, really, really good at catching panic options from the opponent, now that lead. But Sizzle gonna call you out there. <laughs> hey, I've got something for that panic option right there, buddy. Even stocks 2-2 two -two for both these players. And that is the snake trademark right there. Dash just ever so slightly forward, just for positioning and just trying to scare your opponent into walking into an up tilt. So anything you can do to get back in this game against Hero. Of course, Hero, like again, like you're down here and now, now this is what you can do, game, one, we saw, of course, it wasn't actually Sensei who did it. But again, a good game plan of just rushing down this character so you don't have time to pick your spells. But that was a crazy combination. That was actually insane. Kaboom's really strong, puts on a lot of damage, and uh, also kills really early, too, sometimes, depending on where you can catch people. But uh, it, it's disgusting. Anyway, forward throw, definitely one of the funniest forward throws in the game. He just grabs him, just hawks him. <laughs> just get it, just... Huah. Here we go. We have Herjet coming on stage again. Here goes the, <laughs> uh, the psych up up throw. Get him out of here. Send him to the heavens. Now, one sock away from dropping out of this tournament. <laughs> Accelerado on my Accelerado and boo bounce. But Sensei, not worried about whatsoever. Going for the trump, but not going to find that timing, unfortunately. Having that Accelerado too was actually insane because they were able to just recover without using Uppy at that point in time just because you drift like crazy. Fantastic DI on that, by the way. Just your percentage was just too high. Oh yeah, that was an unfortunate way for that to go, but still we have 34% here, finding a nice little conversion there with the C4. Again, Herjet keeping it very, very close, going off stage there for that down air. It's an aggressive option, sneaking up there with the snake in the F till. Now finally taking the lead back. And Solo doesn't have time to think, because once you're up pressuring this hero, you have time to look at the spell list 
And at the ledge here too, Zoom finally coming out for the first time in a while. He goes, he went for the grab there. You know exactly what he wanted. Oh, wow, that was huge. Being able to get that air dodge right before the Cypher's destroyed. That was dang. Oh, bounce and run up into the up till. Are you for real? Oh man, the sweet chin music never disappoints. My goodness. My God, dude, okay. Honestly- I'll take a game five between these two though. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm definitely all here for it. Okay, like as meme worthy at that look at, at the end, like honestly, like rushing down, like you're rushing down having bounce on like, okay, Snake can't do anything here. Saying, wait a minute, you've got an up tilt, buddy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just straight up just doing it. Like that's the way you gotta approach this matchup as coach hero. Like saying like, okay, you need to, obviously the down special is very, very good, but I'm able to pressure it the right way and keep you guessing and keep you on your feet. That's how I win the set. And mm -hmm. that's what I'm saying that the two games that uh, Sensei's taken so far, it has been just like keeping the pressure on the opponent. Yeah, I, I think a big part of this too is um, Sensei has been changing up their recovery patterns. Uh, Cause there's a couple scenarios where you're like, I have to press the recovery button now or they're definitely gonna kill me. And it's just like, surprise, hero can still reach you. But also just being a bit more mindful about the options, like recovering low more often. Cause hero has some tools to deal with that, but against snake, it's, it's a little more limited. So, which is kind of one of the things you have to change up your mindset, because a lot of snakes, they like to recover high, but for this one matchup, it seems like going low is the better option. Oh yeah, 100%. And now, speaking of going low, we've got some nice jabs that resets there. I mean, we're playing very, we're, we're in the money in this game. Those guys are both turning up here, trying to find them up to on that platform. And there's now we're seeing her, again, the aggression coming out from the snake. The snake is turning up. Again, like, like the ledge trapping at this point, like I'm loving how he's not really committing too hard to it. Like not opting for the up smashes or, or the grenades too much. He said like, you know what? You're probably gonna get a zoom. So, Ooh! Dude, he had the flame proof boots and went through that fireball <laughs> and then absolutely destroyed them once they both got back to stage. Dude, that was nuts. <laughs> he spot dodged Hatchet Man and hit him with Hatchet Man in the tilt. Oh, no way! Yeah. Dude, oh my God. You imagine if that hit? Fourth under the whack. That would have been actually crazy. I think I've seen a clip for that before, but yeah, this is definitely a, a wild set as well. Uh, not as crazy as last set, but it's still quite goofy. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Oh, now Solo trying to get back into this. Flame Flash, Hoke, do, it, do, it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Coward. Come on. All right, there but you know what? That lead that led to the smarter play. Where do you it. Just got no. The level two side B and uh, yeah. Yeah, of course, you can't blame him. In, in, game, in game five, he's locked in. Bounce online, finally, to avoid that explosion there, which would have actually disrupted this combo. From the side, be coming out again. Recovering low, like you said. But the thing is, you recover too low way too many times. You get called out hard. Sola now taking that lead back from her jet. I think that uh, Sola has just kind of figured out, like, running... Oh. Wow, running off stage and then, like, ret doing the retreating down there is the better play than just trying to do it from the ledge. Oh, 100%. You know, like, the way that he's been uh, adapting to the snake. <laughs> oh! The parry? The C4? Yo, he's just running. Yo, yo, hold on. That, that's C4. <laughs> oh, if he was not grabbing the ledge, he could have downbeat and taken that stock off Sola. Oh, he switched it's it off. On him. It's on his head. It's on his forehead. Oh. Oh, yeah, okay. Good timing there. The F-Till is going to do it. Finally, his last stock scenario for both these players. Project at 117 with all this rage in the snake. Be very scary situation. Here comes the F on the platform. The he doesn't get the bounce. That's actually huge for Sensei. Oh! The whack! Are you? <laughs> Yo, bro. Are you serious? I know. I know. If Max Ketchum is watching this somewhere right now, he's he's just throwing his hands in the air. He hates this character. <laughs> Yo, if I'm if I'm Jimmy, I'm pissed. <laughs> um, I'm not. It's hero shenanigans. <laughs> I like, that's the thing. It's like, I've gotten into this mentality whenever I compete. I just know there's so much silly stuff in this game that I'm just going to like, just giggle at it anyway. But that was definitely a fun set though. Sola and Sensei definitely coming out here, doing uh, some amazing stuff, uh, putting on a show. <laughs> that's, and that's then right here, ready? What? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, this was fun. This was a lot of fun. Yeah, that was a great set. I mean, these two played it so well. I mean, in the end, right? It was just the nonsense won, won the day. Honestly, 
A win for nonsense is a win for the people. That was I mean, very, very enjoyable. Loser's bracket still nonsense. We got Phantom versus Sola. <laughs> That's going to be, that That might quite possibly might be the best set of all time. Like, loser's bracket alone is literally the nonsense bracket. We've got all the actual players, like the lappers and winners. We got Pharaoh and Smash Bros. Like, <laughs> the going at it. Players? That's the, crazy. The labbers. I said labbers. Don't put words in my mouth. Don't do <laughs> me like sworn, this, Gif. I could have sworn I heard the actual players. <laughs> nah.